Hey, what's going on YouTube? This is your Asian Sensation here, and I'm here bringing you another weapon spotlight, or showcase, and, uh, it is the, um, hang on, I forgot the name of it already, um, yeah, Dragon Greatsword. Uh, it's another great weapon. It's pretty cool. It's kind of rem just reminds me of this, like, a sword version of that, uh, great king axe that you chop off from the gaping dragon. Anyway, so uh, it's pretty awesome. It's uh, basic attacks here. It takes up so much stamina. Um, I'll just show off a few uh, like that. And then of course, just like uh, the other great weapon, um, it has a special attack that you use when you wield it with two hands. Um, I'm going to do it far away so I don't accidentally hit that guy for whatever reason. So, here it is. I think that's pretty awesome. Good for enemies in front of you or in a line. Uh, yeah. So, it's pretty simple to get this weapon, actually. Um, if you go... If you go past the... Uh, I'm in Ash Lake. If you go past the giant hydra that's out there and you find this area through a few secret walls from Blight Town, uh, and you haul ass past the Hydra, or you kill him, oh, oh tail respawn, anyway, so, this tail, right here, uh, if you hit it a few times, it should cut off, and it won't aggro him, so you can still join his covenant, or whatever, and it won't anger him or anything, and it won't count as a sin, so you can still join his covenant, and, uh, it's just right here. It pops off, and uh, you pick it up, and there you go. You have a, a pretty awesome sword. Um, it requires 50 strength to wield one hand, so make sure you invest some points and some strength as well if you want to use this weapon. I think it's pretty cool. I might use this a little bit while longer for before I switch back to my other one. Um, <coughs> so yeah, there it is.